came out of the womb smiling and hasn't stopped since. I am immensely proud of the child she was and the exquisite young woman she's grown up to be. My friendship with Elliot developed when he used to invite me round to his home at lunchtime to watch episodes of Jerry Springer. Though actually, I first met Elliot at chess club in school. Most people went there to avoid the rain at lunchtime, but some of us ended up playing for the school team. She does look spectacular, doesn't she? Yeah. Well, it's been a great sounding board over the years for many things. Some important, some trivial, and some downright silly. Elliot is a great and truly popular guy who has made us all laugh. We all love him and wish him and Hayley many years of happiness together. You look so beautiful, beautiful. Hailey. You're getting For the signing of the Ontario documents, I'd like to invite Scott and Samantha to come up. Elliot, do you agree to abide by the obligations of the Ketuvah and to live with Haley as a proper Jewish husband? Haley, do you agree to abide by the commitments and terms of this Ketubah and to live with Elliot as a proper Jewish wife. Haley, may you be fruitful and prosper. May God make you as Sarah, Rebecca, Rachel, and Leah. May Adonai bless you and protect you. May Adonai show you kindness and grant you peace. for the newlyweds. Love and respect each other. Learn how to agree to disagree nicely. Never stop dating. Never stop having fun, very important. Create a clear vision of your shared future together. A successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. I hope tonight will become one of your most cherished memories and the beginning of many, many more to come. A year ago, that he wanted to talk to me about some furniture for Haley. Danielle and I knew that wasn't it. Mr. Young made me cry. One week passed, two weeks passed, three weeks passed. He finally called me and he asked me, could he have Haley's hand in marriage? I said, fine, that's great. We, we'd love that. I lost my but he said, there's a problem. I haven't asked Haley yet. I'm going to speak to her shortly. One week passed. Two weeks passed. Three weeks passed. And you think it was easy keeping it from Danielle telling all her friends? Every 20 minutes, did he call? Did he call? Elliot, we would like to officially welcome you to our family.
May the one who is supreme in power, blessing and glory, bless this Chatan, Elliot, and this Kala, Haley. We welcome you. With this moment, your hopes are being fulfilled. This moment is a merging of two paths of life into one. Ruchim Habaim, we welcome you to a loving marriage. As you share this wine, so may you share all things from this day on with love and understanding. May life's joys be heightened, its bitterness sweetened, and each of its moments hallowed. is simple without precious stones and its wholeness symbolizes the beautiful way our bride and groom complement each other. Harayat. Harayat. <laughs> Mikudeshet. Mikudeshet. Say li. Li. Bitabat zo. Bitabat zo. Kadat Moshe. Kadash Moshe. Vi Yisrael. Vi Yisrael. By this ring. By this ring. You are consecrated to me. You are consecrated to me. As my wife. As my wife. In accordance with the laws of Moses. In accordance with the laws of Moses. And the people of Israel. And the people of Israel. To place Elliot's ring on his right index finger. And repeat after me these words. Hareata. Hareata. Mikudash. Mikudash. Say Li. Li. Bitabaat Zo. Bitabaat Zo. Kadat Moshe. Kadat Moshe. Vi Yisrael. Vi Yisrael. By this ring. By this ring. You are consecrated to me. You are consecrated to me. As my husband. As my husband. In accordance with the laws of Moses. In accordance with the laws of Moses. And the people of Israel. And the people of Israel. Well, Haley and Elliot, you are now legally bound to each other in accordance with Jewish law. And getting to know you a bit uh, over the last years, we've prepared together for this day, where I really see the Ruach HaCheret is the way in which you appreciate and admire the different qualities which each of you possesses, understand your differences in temperament as complementing rather than challenging each other, and the great sense of humor that you bring to life's inevitable challenges. Today you cross over together into a new land, the land of marriage. Everyone here prays that you will find this land to be one which is Zavat Chalav Udvash, flowing with milk and honey. And when two souls that are destined to be together find each other, my prayer for you this day is you make this commitment to each other as that you find the land of marriage into which you are crossing today to be a source of goodness, comfort, growth, and mutual sustenance for many, many long and happy years ahead. Let the mountains of Israel dance. Let the gates of Jerusalem ring with the sounds of joy, song, merriment, and delight, the voice of the groom and the voice of the bride, and the happy shouts of their friends and companions. Well, since both of you have acted out of love and affection, acting in accordance with the rites and ceremonies instituted by our holy Torah, and in accordance with the laws of the province of Ontario, you, Elliot, and you, Haley, are now husband and wife. We conclude a Jewish wedding, as you know, with the smashing of a glass. This act reminds us of the broken souls in this world who yet wait for a day of celebration and joy. So may Haley and Elliot's happiness be multiplied. Mazel tov. Mazel tov. Mazel tov. What a wonderful wedding. 
I think this is absolutely beautiful. Everybody here is so excited to see this wonderful couple and I love seeing all your faces. You will not get a big speech on how great Haley was a sister, which she was, or how much I care about her, which I do, or how happy I am that she's marrying a nice guy, which I am. Haley has always been a cherished daughter and granddaughter, a loyal friend, a diligent student, a hard worker, but most importantly, Haley has always had a beautiful soul, and in Elliot she has found her soulmate. What can I say about Elliot? We have all seen your love and respect of family, and what better way to judge a future husband and son-in-law's character than to observe a devoted grandson, son, and brother. Hayley, you are my best friend, my love, my partner. Your kindness knows no bounds and your loyalty is unwavering. You are always there for me and I want to always be there for you. You are beautiful both inside and out. And I'm sure everyone will agree, you look absolutely stunning tonight. Hayley Pascal, my HP source. The yin to my yang, you are intelligent, generous, hardworking, popular, and let's be very clear, a brilliant judge of character. As time passes, I guess both our gift wrap will get a bit tatty, but there's no one in the world I would rather be with when this happened than you. I'd like to make one final toast, if you could be upstanding for the last time, to my ex-girlfriend, my wife, the newest Mrs. Warren, the bride. <laughs> 